Hi, Robert Curry again, Innovative Air Solutions. We are continuing our series on system components. Uh, today, what I have is called a sequencer. Uh, this is a heat sequencer that is uh, uh, more specifically called a heat sequencer. Uh, this little device typically will run our fan or our indoor blower motor on air handler applications. We'll also turn on and off our electric heat strips. Okay, very, very simple device, but very powerful in what it does. Uh, also very reliable in operation. On a typical heat sequencer, we have several terminals. Uh, don't want to be confusing with them, but there are just several terminals on here. Uh, but you will notice a wire running between these two terminals. And if I turn this around, there's a wire running between these two terminals. That means that we just can connect wires to here. Everything will operate both relays, okay? The relays here will typically be, we will have power applied to this side. This will be our line voltage power and our load side will be here. So as an example, we'll have power coming from our disconnect box to this relay right here. We'll always be hot. And as this uh, sequencer is off, nothing happens. But as we apply power, we have a plunger that moves forward as we apply low voltage power. And it actually applies power to this terminal right here which in turn causes our electric heat or our motor to turn on. Uh, typical failures we see with these things are the, they will no longer go up and apply power. Uh, one of the first things to check is to make sure we're getting our 24 volts or our low voltage to the bottom of the terminals. And then one by one, we can stage up. These will stage in a, based on a timed event, okay? So as an example, with electric heat, we don't necessarily want the blower coming on first or we'll be blowing cold air down the ducts. So typically what we will do is we will stage our heat on a terminal like this. And then the second terminal, as it's, as it's moving forward, making contact, the second thing to turn on will be the blower. So that way it gives a time delay between the time the electric heat turns on and the time the blower runs on, uh, turns on so that we can blow warm air down the duct and not cold air and uh, thus uh, keep us from getting a couple of customer complaints. Uh, again, this is just called a heat sequencer. It's a 24 volt relay. Uh, sometimes you'll see these singly or you'll see uh, a double stack is what this is called. Uh, so these can come in many different configurations, but they all operate basically the same way. If you have any further questions, call Innovative Air Solutions 409-883-9616. Thank you.